Hey everybody, Jittery J here. Hope everybody's having a great day so far. I know I'm going to make it a little brighter this time around because we have none other than Ginger Billy to react to. This man gets up to some of the craziest antics and this one is likely to be no different. It's called How Lethal Is My Redneck Bazooka. Um, <laughs> after seeing his battle tank, I'm scared uh, to even ask that question but i guess we're going to find out but first we're going to jump over here to the original video and give this man a like and subscribe he, he deserves all the support we can give him he is absolutely hilarious um then we're going to come back here and hit like and subscribe on this video let me know in the comments anything you want to see me react to and i will get to that as soon as i can um make sure you tap the notification bell so you know when i upload more content and let's get into this i love this guy Hello, Marco, and hello to everybody else all around the world. Now, as you can see here, I have got a homemade launching device in my hands. You see, me and Bobby, we created these three launching devices with three different size barrels. As you can see, I done went and bought me some ballistic gels. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, feeling like Kentucky ballistics, you know, demolition ranch. Um, but as you can see, I just got the heads the hands and the feet because like the, the whole torso with the head was like five thousand dollars jesus scott matt how much for something you're just gonna destroy holy hell was like five thousand dollars scott matt how much money are you making on these videos fellas huh i couldn't afford that so i just had to get little body parts to shoot okay but i still think it's gonna be really cool now let's get back to our projectiles as you can see here, we have a drill bit oh, shit. that I have duct taped the end to, and we're going to see what kind of damage this does to the ballistic gels. And then we got ourselves a golf ball. The one I'm really excited about, okay, is the marbles and the BBs. Oh, Bobby's shit. not too good at putting things in holes. <laughs> at least that's what his wife says. <laughs> All right, we got it. <laughs> Let's cut <it> up. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> He's not so good at putting things in holes. <laughs> not so good at putting things in holes. At least that's what his wife says. Alright, we got it. Alright, here we go. Oh no. Oh, oh shit. Just nicked it. Okay, so apparently I just skimmed the top of his head. Well, look, I, I ripped that skull back. I, I scalped him with that golf ball. <laughs> I hit the bone yeah. with that golf ball. You heard that. sound like a darn 20-gauge shotgun right there. Okay, so with the first attempt, I aimed a little high. Um, I was nervous. I ain't going to lie to you. Uh, but even with me skimming the top of this dummy's head, it gave him a higher cut. Penetrated my haircut. His skull. Now I'm aim lower. Let's see if I can knock out some toofies. Toofies. Love his burp, his verbiage, or vocabulary. Oh, now I'm aim lower. Let's see if I can knock out some toofies. See if the old tooth fairy will visit this fella tonight. So I'm aim from here down to see if I can make a real good, firm connection with his face. Ah, damn. Oof. Broke his nose. Hit him right in his nasal area. Oh, he gonna need some plastic surgery, baby. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, broke his nose Ooh. off. Look at that damage. Look, all right, so you got that right there. That broke the skin, right? She's like, oh, it broke skin. Oh, no, 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 no. No, it broke bones. Look at What is that? It's an orbital socket. Ouch. I mean, it crushed it, man. That fella right there, he, he's blind out that eye now. He ain't gonna be seeing nothing. That yeah. eyeball be done pushed all the way back there to the back <laughs> of his head. That was a whole lot of power uh. going through that face right there. I mean, look, this right here ain't connected. Look, it's, it's out there. Look at her. I'd say that launcher number one was a success. God dang, that's probably the first thing me and Bobby's ever had at work, right? 
Respect. <laughs> All right, Nick. <laughs> oh shit I like that that's probably the first thing we've ever had that worked right <laughs> that's a scary thought because especially with all the stuff he gets into it's a very scary thought <laughs> that's probably the first thing me and Bobby's ever had that worked right <laughs> alright and next up we got my sniper rifle oh yeah I got a scope I mean it don't really work I mean the scope works but it ain't in line with the barrel, okay? Uh, which is why I'm only shooting these ballistic gels from like five foot away, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to hit them, all right? Yeah. I ain't trying to snipe them. We have a drill bit. Oh yeah, that's gonna do a lot of damage, a lot of penetration, if you know what I'm saying. Nah. You just bounce straight off. What do you got to say for yourself? No penetration. As is in regular life with me, <laughs> I penetrate about one out of every ten times. <laughs> that's, that's a little bit too much information. <laughs> you see why I love this guy? <laughs> Life, me, I penetrate about one out of every ten times. Oh god! So since the drill bit just absolutely blew it, literally, we're gonna move on to our next projectiles, which I have a lot of hope for. All right, ladies and gents, we have our homemade bird shot. I got high hopes. Got oh oh god! Hope. Oh, I want this to destroy this jail so bad. Nope. Oh, bounce off. Look <laughs> <laughs> at all that damage. I just wiped away this fella's tears. <laughs> we going back to Big Bertha because she's the only one that was doing some damage. We uh -huh. have here a steel ball bearing. Okay, oh, 16 ounces of nothing but pain. If you're wondering, man, why is it that every time these fellers make an invention, it only works half the time? That is because me and Bobby, we're not engineers. <laughs> we're rednecks. <laughs> and we look at stuff and we say, you know what, I bet that'd be cool to do. And then we... <laughs> it's called redneck rehabilitation. That's what it is. That's what you use duct tape for. <laughs> try it, and it either works or it fails, <laughs> as you have seen today. Ouch. That did some damage. Oh. <laughs> it about knocked the darn head off the table. Look, look inside of his head. Look inside of that. Destroy him. Destroy him. God dang. It broke his neck. Look, it broke his vertebras. Oh, he's, he's paralyzed. He's down and out. That man is dead. I just <laughs> killed that man with a ball bearing and a tater launcher. <laughs> Bam! Let's do a medical examination, shall we? Now, the ball bearing comes out of the barrel. It hits my man right in the eye socket. It absolutely destroys that bone look there ain't no bone there it went through through there look i mean his whole skull is cracked cracked look right there look he's doa son he's dead on arrival <laughs> gang gang <laughs> so after i shot that 16 ounce ball bearing me and bobby was walking around i was like where is it because if i hit it with a bush hog and it goes through my house it came back bobby is gonna be in a lot of trouble so we start looking around, and then Bobby's like, man, look how this dude's head lay. So I look over here, and I look inside. Come here. Oh, it's Upon still inside it. Inspection, that ain't no tumor right there. It's a tumor. That is the ball bearing. So yeah. the ball bearing went through this man's occipital lobe 
got stuck in the back of his skull. Yeah. And there it is. It's probably what cracked right it. Right there. <laughs> right oh, there. Yeah. push oh. brain matter. Look, it's got goo on it. That's brain matter. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this fella here reminds me of... <laughs> <laughs> my son, you know, when you ask him something, he's like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That's exactly what my son looks like 99% of the time. Uh -huh. So I ain't no medical physician or nothing, uh, but I'm just going to go out on a limb and say, this fella here, he's in heaven now. He's with Jesus. <laughs> or if he's Muslim, he's with Allah, which, or Buddha, whatever, you know. And this fella here, he's, he's, uh, pieces of him is in heaven. You know, uh, yeah, he's dead. There ain't no doubt about it. <laughs> um, now, we're gonna shoot the golf ball again. But this time, we're gonna pretend that this is Bobby. And I'm gonna tell Bobby, I'm gonna say, Bobby, catch! And Bobby's gonna throw his hand up. And I'm gonna launch his golf ball into his palm. Now, Bobby has some very dainty, girly hands, okay? Uh, these are much more manly hands than Bobby's. Okay. So if it damages this hand, oh goodness gracious, Bobby's it'd be bad. He'd probably destroy it. Ooh. Ouch. Broke a few fingers. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Spun it sideways, broke a few fingers. Oh, that ain't supposed to be like that. <laughs> I ain't no orthopedist. But that finger mm -hmm. is supposed to be up there. What is it? It's over there. Whoo! Looks like he only That's broke one. Cool. I thought he broke two. Me and Bobby is so scientific. I thought he broke two of them. It's a golf ball. Me and Bobby is so scientific. Scientific. Have... Scientific. Okay. Like I said, I love his vocabulary. <laughs> Offball. <clears throat> Me and Bobby is so scientific that we have made a golf ball come out at the sound of light. <laughs> the the sound of light. It's the sound of light. <laughs> The sound of light. <laughs> At the speed of light. At the speed of light. <laughs> Told you ain't no scientist. But look at that right there. If that was Bobby's hand right there, them fingers right there be gone. Yeah. Bobby just be able to give a thumbs up or like that right there. And them three fingers would be done disappeared. So since our homemade bird shot with the little BBs didn't work, you know, it just kind of hit the feller in the face and they all just uh, rebounded right back towards my face. We decided to go up a notch. Uh, this ain't bird shot. This oh, is no. alien shot. We took marbles, about 20 of them. We're going to launch them through this hand right here. Oh, here. I forgot he had the marbles the in the jar. We're going to see what kind of damage it can do. Or in the bag. Oh, shit. Mostly just knocked it off the nail. Thing had so much power. I think it broke that bone right there. You can't really see any outer physical damage, but it made it floppy. So I'm pretty sure it broke something, you know. Not the best of shots, but a really cool shot. <laughs> and the fact that we did lay some marbles in the mason jar has to give us some points. <laughs> I have had a lot of fun today with our homemade launchers. I hope y'all enjoyed it. God bless y'all. I love you. Yeah. Oh, this hand really ain't even damaged too bad. Oh, I think I'm gonna hang out with you later. <laughs> Palm <Pommel. laughs> Are you filming right now? Turn the camera off. Hello, my. <laughs> Sorry. Are you filming right now? <laughs> Pamela Henderson. <laughs> Like I said, I love this guy. He is an absolute trip. <laughs> I can't get enough of him. Uh, anyway, I I really, really want to know as you guys think of him. And yeah, so let me know in the comments 
what you guys thought about this video. Let me know what else I need to look for uh, from Ginger Belly or anyone else. And I will get to it as soon as I can. Um, that being said, if you haven't done so yet, I'd like to ask you to hit that like and subscribe. It'd be greatly appreciated. It helps the channel grow and it shows up in the algorithm. Or shows up in the uh, analytics. Is what I'm trying to say. It lets me know you guys want more content like this. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this with me. And I hope to see you on the next one. I love you guys. Peace.